all go through this life hoping that one day somebody is gonna liberate us from the chains and the shackles that we have upon us, placed by society, placed by our parents, religion, or any type of limits. My life was liberated by myself. There was nobody there to come and help me. It was not until I was at the bottom that I realized that nobody was gonna come pick me up. I had to rise by myself. And once I realized that, I felt a freedom in my life that I've never experienced before. It's painful, but it's liberating. People have this illusion that freedom comes without pain. It doesn't. They go hand in hand. And only when you are strong enough to deal with the pain is when you're strong enough to be free. It comes with a price. It comes with sacrifice. It comes with suffering. It comes with suffering more than you've ever suffered before. Only then will you realize what you're really capable of. Only then will you realize your own capacity in this life. So let my voice be the liberation for anybody out there seeking to release the chains from themselves. I now, with my voice speaking to you, give you the permission to live your life freely, to live your life on your terms, to live your life the way you wanna live it. Because at the end of the day, you're the one that's gonna deal with the consequences. You're the one that's gonna deal with the aftermath. You're the one that's gonna to have to take responsibility for it. There's nobody else's fault but yours. There's nobody else's responsibility but yours. So instead of pointing fingers and blaming everybody else for why you're not doing what you're doing, for why you're not living the life you're living, go to the bathroom and look yourself in the fucking mirror and see that person, see the person who's responsible. That's you. We all wanna rise in life, but nobody wants to fall before they do. And in order to rise, you gotta fall. That's the way it works. In order to live, you gotta die. And I'm speaking from a term of realizing that there's certain parts about yourself that you have to get rid of. There's certain parts of yourself that you have to let go. There's certain parts about yourself that makes you weak. And in order to be that person you want to be in order to be where you want to be in life you got to get rid of that you got to get rid of those habits those 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 mindsets those ways of thinking those people around you those those uh, ways of acting that's not serving you well that's not benefiting you whoever taught you that serving yourself is bad is somebody to look out for because you only have yourself, and it's from yourself that you operate, right? So you gotta make sure that you are good. You gotta make sure that you stand on your two feet. You gotta make sure that you are strong enough on your own to deal with life before you can take on anything else, right? So that's why I'm here. Not because I'm lucky. Not because I was born with fucking having things on a civil platter. I had to do the work, and so do you. Liberate yourself. You're the only one that has the key to the 